Now see in this find maximum frequency and minimum wavelength of X rays produced by 30 kV kilovolt electrons H is equal to 6.63 into 10 raised to power minus 34 joule second. So, we have to calculate first maximum frequency. So, you know we can write here E v is equal to H into nu and nu is equal to E v upon H and E v that is E is given to you 1.6 into 10 raised to power minus 19 that is coulomb. V is a potential difference that is given to 30 kilo volt. So, we can write 30 into 10 raised to power 3 volt divided by 6.63 into 10 raised to power minus 34 joule second. So, we will be getting by solving this 7.24 into 10 raised to power 18 hertz. So, this is the here maximum frequency produced by this x rays. Now, we can calculate also wavelength from the same equation here. So, we can take there is another way also we have got the frequency we can calculate the wavelength because we know the speed of x rays that is 3 into 10 raised to power 8 meter per second. Otherwise, we can go from here also. So, when we calculate the wavelength we can write E v is equal to h c by lambda. So, this will be here the minimum wavelength because the frequency is maximum. So, lambda is equal to h c upon e, e v and here we have already you know the this value know it 6.63 into 10 raised to power minus 34 3 into 10 raised to power 8 divided by 1.6 into 10 raised to power minus 19 into 3 into 10 raised to power 4 that is a here in meters. Now, we can solve it and we will be getting in nanometers that is coming here 0 0.041 nanometer. So, we can calculate the wavelength by this formula and directly you can also you should have used just by taking the frequency and that means uh, you know that is a velocity c is equal to nu into lambda by using this also you should have solved it.